Hello, everyone. Happy Monday. New Jersey Senator Bob Benendez is standing defiant and pushing past growing calls to resign. Just days after getting indicted for the second time in his career on federal bribery charges. The allegations leveled against me are just that, allegations. I recognize uh, this will be the biggest fight uh, yet, but as I have stated throughout this whole process, I firmly believe that when all the facts are presented, not only will I be exonerated, but I still will be the New Jersey's senior senator. Menendez spoke publicly, to, publicly today for the first time since federal prosecutors charged him over an alleged corruption scheme. They are accusing the senator and his wife of accepting hundreds of thousands of dollars in bribes in exchange for favors for three New Jersey businessmen and the government of Egypt. When federal agents searched Menendez's home last year, they found a Mercedes-Benz, more than $100,000 worth of gold bars, and nearly half a million dollars in cash hidden in envelopes, jackets, and closets, all tied, they say, to the scheme. Menendez addressed the cash directly today, claiming the money came from his own savings account. For 30 years, I have withdrawn thousands of dollars in cash from my personal savings account, which I have kept for emergencies and because of the history of my family facing confiscation in Cuba. Now, this may seem old-fashioned, but these were monies drawn from my personal savings account based on the income that I have lawfully derived over those 30 years. Leading Democrats in Menendez's home state of New Jersey are calling on him to resign from the Senate, as well as fellow Senators John Fetterman and Sherrod Brown. The question now is how long is he willing to hang on, facing a case with a lot of damning evidence? Thanks so much for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.